Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our Limitless SMP series. Today I got maybe Katie again here with me, my lovely wife. My chaos in a nutshell. So, what is the plan for today, honey? We built our house. So, last episode we built this little house here. And this was a little prefab one. Um, obviously... Uh, it's small uh, doesn't give us a lot to work with so uh, there's this wonderful tool called create and with create you can make what's called schematics um, these schematics can be used um, so if you create a building or something like that you can turn around and put them in a cannon like we got up over here and then when you got all your required supplies uh, you can go ahead and fire up the cannon and the cannon will build the building that you have in the schematic so what we've done here is um, Katie built our new house in creative and then we're using the schematic from create to go ahead and bring it over into the survival world so I think we're gonna do that with a couple of our builds um, the schematic cannon I've never used it before I don't exactly know how this is gonna turn out it might be really good it might be really bad I have no idea um, and you might see right now we're a little more geared up than what we used to be um, as you can tell uh, she's got some gear on I've got some gear on um, we've got a couple horses so we are making progress off the camera um, and if you want to see that, uh, we do stream on Twitch. So like in, or in between episodes when we're working on stuff, um, I guess, quote unquote, off the YouTube, uh, we do go live on Twitch and stream in between. But yeah, she's going to work on getting some supplies there. And then while she's doing that, uh, I'm going to go out and explore a little bit. Every time. Okay. So horse armor we got the new horse armor so this horse armor that we've got going on here it is enchanted with frost walker which freezes the player freezes water under the player into frosted ice while for us that would be a good thing as a player on a horse it's even better so oh yeah much arrows from the raid but on a horse this allows us to traverse the water at a much higher speed than what we were doing before now we can just run across the water um, and freeze it, which is super nice for traversing water. Um, but yeah, it's something something new for sure. We were going to go south and see what we got going on here. I haven't taken the opportunity to kind of explore. I know we did that in the first video, but we got so out of hand and like trying to get done what we were intending to do. I didn't really do much. A really big dodo bird. All I can think of those. The uh, cocobo? Uh huh. Or chocobo? We don't have any sand, do we? You need me to grab your sand? Yes, please. I need glass. Okay. So well, I guess we're going to gather, gather sand. I just need Candy Beach, and I forgot to grab a shovel. Grab sand quick. And then we'll go back on her adventure here. Got some sand. Her. Be right back. Okay. Alright, we've got our sand. Can you work along here? Seeing what we've got. I am of some sort with some more barley. Oh, another village up here. 
northern variety. Oh wow. The horse has multi jump now because of my arm or the horse's arm. Oh my armor. Somehow the horse gets multi jump too. Not sure. Look, there's another village just out here. We're gonna need to borrow some villagers as them. I need to run back to the house, help her with the andesite quick, and be back with you. I've got that done. Plus I do a little time lapse of traveling up to you guys. If you guys want to see like time lapses instead of cuts, I'm more than happy to do that. You guys just gotta let me know uh, in the future what you want. Oh look, meteorite. Oh cool. Oh look, andesite. Better. They even see me running back all the way out? Well, I still gotta go home anyway, but... In a second. Okay, I'll just grab this here for a second. Couldn't take... How much in a second do you need? Not enough. A fair amount. <laughs> That's all you need to know, just a fair amount. Alright, well, we'll grab this in a second, and then we'll go back home. It's, it's right here. Leaves me running down into the mine shaft. Speaking of mine shafts and stuff, we need to spend a day and set up a automated miner. Yes. Whether that's through Create or uh, there's the Cory's mod in here as well, because you know we have a mod for pretty much everything in this mod pack, so and that's always a bonus for stuff too. That if there's something you want to do. Or you can do it. It exists. But let me wrap up with this quick. Right back with you guys. Honey. Yes. I found some yellow cows with flowers on them. They're no blooms. And if you shear them, then you can get flowers. Flower cows. Yeah. And like the mushroom cows, which we did pick one up um, in between uh, last episode and this episode. And we actually ended up picking it up from um, this thing kind of looks like uh, Stonehenge. I guess it's a good thing, a good way of calling it. It looks like Stonehenge. The only thing I know how to call it. That's quite interesting, for sure. Honey, I'm home. Which needs stuff. Let me hire here and You've been a good steed today. Good steed. You need stuff. What? I'm gonna throw a bunch of stuff out of you. Ready? Oh, don't put that there. When it can't get in, it's probably gonna break it do this so then I can sleep during the night when I get things done. You have your magnetics thing on. Oh, no. You got it. Uh, looked as if you were... Yeah. To get some server side of stuff. I'm not... Oh, good. I need to make more furnaces, I just realized. How many more furnaces? I just need to make some furni. A bunch of cobblestone. Uh, topic. Oh gosh. What did I do? Did a thing. That was a that little deal is it's like part of our quests. Um it's I don't care for it. Because they have like random rewards, and at some point, yes, we will go through and open these loot crates and these cute little loot bundles. Um, we'll make a whole video out of that because the stuff that we can pull out of that is just bonkers, and I'm not sure I'm ready for overpowered stuff yet. Like, we just started, we're getting ready to build our first house, uh, I'm not ready for it. 
and I don't know if anybody noticed it last video that is a villager statue and we got a bee statue there's a bee statue so that's a villager statue I didn't notice it immediately um, and then I had a buddy of mine who was watching the video he pointed it out it is actually a villager statue and then there's a bee in the sky or kind of looks like a bee you know? go to the other side of it I believe you but then we have the working lighthouse which is great okay so what we're gonna do guys is as soon as we get all the materials put together um, we'll go ahead and get ready to push the button but I'm gonna take a little bit of time here and we're going to go ahead and get everything put together so we can use this cannon so I will cycle back with you as soon as we get those materials together okay I think we finally got everything this took way longer than intended but <laughs> I uh, I think we're finally finally ready to push the buttons in honey this was your build do you want the the honors of, of pushing the button sure you'll just push the play button that one shooting thing. I don't know what's going Oh, it might be blocks. I don't know. Clearing blocks at the moment. We're gonna let that... <laughs> right in. So we're gonna <laughs> let that sit and run for a little bit. I'm just gonna time lapse it here, and we're just gonna let it do its thing. So, yeah, after the building's built. Again, uh, in between videos, we are live on Twitch at my Twitch channel, which will be linked below in the description. But yeah, it's our first new building um, of the series. I think it looks just superb. It kind of blends in to the kind of styles we're running. And excellent. I love it. All right, hun. Is there anything else you want to say before we call it here? Nope. I didn't have much to say this episode anyway, so... Yeah, you were definitely focused on what was going on. So, alrighty, folks. Again, we appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you the next time.